In 2021, the Denver metro area saw a 22% increase in its homeless population, with 5,000 people now living in homeless shelters. Here in the Grand Valley, it was a long, hard winter for our local homeless population. KRX 5's Austin Sachs spent today investigating how three local agencies have joined forces to tackle the ongoing challenges of homelessness. He now joins us live in the studio. Rob and Jocelyn, I met with officials at Homeward Bound, who told me here in Grand Junction our homeless population has returned to pre-pandemic totals. They say with the summer season that number may increase, but they hope a new service will finally put more people on the road to permanent shelter. Colorado's Governor Jared Polis met in Denver this week to address homelessness across the state. But state investments alone will not solve the problem. Our local leaders in urban and suburban communities need to step up and address the issue. Local organizations, including Homeward Bound and Royce Hearst Humane Society, are wasting no time addressing the situation by introducing a new service set to launch in two weeks. Oh, we're very excited about it because these pet shelters that are behind us are the first of their kind in the country. Bill Wade, a board chairman of Homeward Bound, says we often see homeless with animals. And sometimes that's the only companion that they have. The Homeward Bound shelter off North Avenue can now house both. There are only nine of them, so that's not nearly enough but it will certainly help us with seeing if this concept works and then we can hopefully make it bigger. The new animal shelter isn't the only addition headed to Homeward Bound. Residents will soon be able to access a new living area with the security of a key card. People will have their entry card to get in and out and much more security and control over their own environment. Wade says when people have more security and freedom to roam, it helps give the homeless dignity. And the more dignity that they have, the more likely they are to stay on the track to get out of homelessness. In 2021 in Grand Junction, the homeless count totaled to 279 in shelters and more than 300 on the streets. In comparison, Denver's homeless population totals more than 5,000. Coloradans are demanding action and it's time to deliver. We're long past finger pointing. It's time to deliver real results in reducing homelessness. Wade says in Grand Junction that's already underway with the new shelter made possible because of a joint partnership between Homeward Bound, Royce Hearst Animal Society, and PetSmart. Homeward Bound hopes taking people and their pets off the street and putting them on the road to a permanent home is the solution. Now this is the first shelter of its kind to house people and their pets. If it proves successful, Grand Junction could be a model for other cities and states across the nation. Reporting live in the studio and first on the Western Slope, I'm Austin Sack, Carrick's 5 News, Robin Jocelyn.